Hello all, thanks for jumping on. I'm doing a special live today. I already forgot what I put down as the title. Uh, so what I want to do, jump on today, I don't prepare my weekly lives, but I'd like to explain my condition a lot more clearer the way I can. Um, so as you know, I have a dis rare disability called Parrot Syndrome. The way I describe it is you need how a baby walks and talks and coordinates and goes forwards. I'm actually going backwards and I don't know when things will happen. Uh, one of the things I have noticed, many things, is my speech. My speech is uh, something I need to keep doing and these lives do actually help. Uh, the one thing I I had a rehab session uh, late last year before this lovely COVID happened and what helped is knowing that I need to slow down my speech and enunciate the words. Um, when I get emotional, even before I had this disability, I cannot be understood as much as I try to do so. And I do get nervous, so my hands are trying to be underneath my legs for the moment. And I've also made sure I bought tissues <laughs> because I'm an emotional talker. And crap, I'm getting emotional already. <laughs> Um, and speaking a lot, gotta make sure you keep your water uptake. Uh, so one of the things I need to explain is, uh, when I do my DMI in the morning, DMI is daily method of operation. It can take me up to two hours to do what can take you 15 minutes. Um, so I see someone's online, uh, can you leave a heart or a thumbs up to let me know you're there as well, that'd be really great. Um, I've got no sizes, <laughs> keep me in check because I can't go off, um, off track. So one of the things I notice is I have to see a podiatrist, podiatrist um, which I, I should have always had to do, but you know, I learn as I go what I do and don't need to do with my life and to help me in any way I can. It's a good thing that I saw the podiatrist because he explained a lot that I wasn't aware of and the way I can also now explain the way I walk is a wide gate and as he mentioned it's like a childlike um, walk so I didn't realise the way to explain it is, hey Joanna, thanks for coming on. The way I explain it is, um, I have a wide gate, so you know how a pregnant lady walks with the wide gate. That's pretty much how I walk. So I've had one off already. Um, one of the things is the way I walk will become an issue with my hips and it's very unfortunate but it's just the way I'm going. Um, I'm to turn off this life. I won't turn off. Just breathe. 
Um, so if I, if I can't do something, I might do it. For example, I, I mentioned that I can. I'll get there. I don't want to get there. But give me a moment or two. <laughs> if that's a thing I keep swimming, I get there. It takes a lot out of me. But I keep going. <sighs> so with my gas bottle, I knew I can't get to where it needed to go. The only thing I want to do is just take it down the hill because I can't walk and carry. I can walk and carry light things, but sugar. That's one of the things I was grateful for when I worked at Bunnings. I let them know what I could and couldn't do. Um, fudge. I didn't want to come on here and be like this, but... It's a lot worse thing than that. A lot worse things people go through out there. Okay. So, yeah. So, it's a good thing I see the podiatrist as well as Things aren't a hill, but to me, they are a hill. Um, that's the condition I have as well. The way I can explain it as well, you know how your bones and joints are without an issue? I actually have a flexible issue. So that's why I do what I can, but when I can't do certain things, I won't do it. Um, sorry, my speech. The restrictions I have is just be slow and take it easy with everything. The only thing I've learned that I can do without any issue <laughs> It's, it's too much TMI, but anyway, is I can get up the loo without help. I will need help later. I know that. And I will ask for help when I need it. That's the thing with me. If I need help, I ask for it. People have asked me for help before I needed help. I'm like, why are you asking? I don't need help. So I do apologize. People who are, <laughs> have asked for help. And I didn't need it then, and it might have seemed like I was pushing them away, but I didn't need help then. But I do need help now, so that's why I'm doing what I get. Thanks for jumping on. Um, before all this disability came along, I could dance, I could run, I could do whatever. 
I had a normal life, no issues. I can go running up and down stairs. I can't do any of that anymore. Um, but what I can do is use this. So I'm grateful that I have this ability to keep using what I have left. And that's the thing I can help in any way I can. And I found a lot of different ways they can help me and any others. Just ask me for help and I can use my, my brain to actually help and get around things like the gas bottle. If people haven't seen, gas bottles are very heavy, but I use my brain. I figured out how to get a heavy object to where it had to be. Um, so I've had wait, I've worked since I was what seventeen and a half, I think. I can't remember. I'm thirty six now. So I've had normal work life. Just my first job was really hard because I'm hearing impaired. I was bullied, but I wasn't aware that I was being bullied. And the thing is, I didn't speak up so they didn't really know that they're being a bully as well. I understand that. But that's not okay. What makes me happy is I like to garden and help people. That is... Something I want to do, help people. Last year I voiced that I wanted to be a counsellor, but that cost way too much of money. <laughs> um, and what I'm doing now with my online business, writing out, being on social media platforms, speaking to so many different people, I'm grateful that I can do so because it's lovely COVID. Most people will have uh, put the effort into work. I'm like, it's hard for me to get her across to say that you, I don't want to say that you don't need to work. I know you need to pay bills, but there are people out there that have reached out and said hello. Hey, going? Can we meet up? Some people actually need to get out and do things as well. Um, so I've had jobs. I've taken down notes, so that's why I keep looking down. With my disability, the other thing is jumping on book, by the way. The other way I can voice my disability is... Uh, I've written it down the wrong way, but i say the way I know it is... You know how you turn on a light switch? And most of the time... The light just turns on. But if you had electric leads or whatever, it, and then turn the light on, it would take a while to get things, get the, the light to be turned on. And that's my condition. It takes a, an effort as well to actually walk and do things so the more I do the more not tired but well, I guess tired in a way 
to keep going and to do things, the more I try to coordinate, the more or less coordinated I get. Um, the other way I can describe my disability is, you know how you put a key in the door or a lock or whatever you want? Just imagine putting a key in the hole and having negative to negative. That without the force, that's my issue as well. Getting things to go in, like it's hard to explain. I hope you get what I mean. Um, and as I mentioned, if I need help. I will ask for help. Uh, I have a GoFundMe. Um, and I do have the government helping me. And that's how I got the dryer. But then, now the issue is they can help with me getting things like the dryer. And they can help me get an aircon or whatever. But they can't help me with bills. So that's why I have a GoFundMe in place. As well as try to get my online business up and going. So when that's up and going, I'll be glad to help anyone that needs it with, you know, aging, skincare, whatever. Just ask me and I can help in any way I can. I would love to help. And I'd love if you'd be able to share this live as well as just mention where you're tuning in from. I forget to ask in my lives where people are tuning in from and I'd love to know where you're tuning in from. <sighs> I'm okay. And that's the thing, you got to talk about things or write it down. It doesn't always help, but it can help if you, <coughs> excuse me, if you try. If it doesn't help, it doesn't help, but at least you tried. And as I say, just follow kindness. I don't know if many of you may know. <laughs> Just follow kindness is my initials, J-F-K, just follow kindness. So I hope people all had a good day, good evening, or wherever you're tuning in from. I thank you very much for taking that time to put up with me, <laughs> being emotional, and doing this live. <coughs> Excuse me. I need water now. It's <laughs> broken so much. I hope you've all had a good day and just for like kindness. <laughs>